Yeah, like... He, he is a very fearsome man, and it looks like Waka got his wish, uh, and it came true. Uh, the <laughs> Luigi is on deck, and it feels like it's gonna have a field day having a Bowser in front of him. Right, oh yes, I remember now. And right, so this is not necessarily something that you see every day because Bowser, once again, being one of the lesser play characters, but not only on that, it's also Luigi, even though we did some action uh, a couple of, of weekends ago with Alec and Game Smash in, in Ultimate Summit. Shout out to Shaq, who did an amazing job there. And this is quite, oh, I thought that was gonna spike my man. That DI in was in. Correct, but it doesn't seem like the game actually allowed Law to be able to concrete that stock as soon as possible. Ooh. Ooh, this is going to be a lot of damage racking up, but the plunger, El Amigo, as we say here in Mexico, everybody knows that El Amigo que te tiro para what? Oh my god, trying to go for, <laughs> for, for, for Mortal Nemesis right there, Roy El Remolain. <laughs> and he's able to actually get out of that situation. The word of the flying slam, not quite going to make him a tortilla, but it's still in a very disadvantageous situation for Law because Luigi is he's not the most popular character to get back to the stage. No, and it's looked like my man Saud has managed to adapt here. <laughs> Does lose the stock quite immediately after taking uh, Law's first with that four tilt. But here, like, the fire has been making wonders, and I mean, we all know it, Luigi's main weakness is the fact that he struggles to get in. Once he's in, like, you're in for a world of hurt, but getting there is what can complicate things, and Bowser does have real fire. This is no Charizard that we have on screen, so that fire will keep you away, will do a ton of damage, and Law, I I'm quite surprised, just overextending, and look at that, interrupting that, I was fully expecting like south there to go off stage and try to meet uh, the luigi now, like the green missile sorry is straight in the face because you can actually do that and getting a trade at that distance unless law managed to make uh, a great play like he would have died when south looking very very poised here to face versus luigi but i do have to point out that it feels like law has also been overextending a lot on some of those punishes and i do think that that is something that uh, Luigi's can sometimes get like stuck into that loop of I am trying to press buttons and since I'm Luigi and I'm very fast uh, uh, frame data wise I can just have that privilege but sometimes it just comes back to bite you in the butt. Yeah, and it's very, very ironic. It's actually the jaws of Bowser, the one that's coming to, to actually bite you in this occasion. And I do feel like this matchup isn't necessarily difficult for Bowser, simply because of the fact that even the, Luigi no longer has those those very extense hitboxes like he had in Smash 4. And you're seeing that even though he does have a protector oh. right there, oh, trying to go for the jab, jab, reverse, pit, uh, the pit grab right there. But it's not just getting out of that situation rapidly. And once again, going for it, it's not quite going in. Seems like Sout is very fast and reactive. And in a way, I do feel like he's playing with some sort of respect because <laughs> it's, complete it's, fear. it's complete respect. And just like, like that, Law just rolls in all barely by the skin of his teeth, by the skin of his mustache. But he's not able to make it back to the ledge. He neutral get up has a bit of a bad DI, I would dare say, and just immediately gets sent into the blast zone. And that's first game for South with a person that, well, that didn't seem to have like too much of an advantage during the first part of the game, actually just came out and clutched it out with a solid two stock. Yeah, Law looking a little rattled right there. Like, uh, that that is the thing about Luigi, right? Like. He, he touches you, he gets going, and uh, like I was saying, it's gonna be a world of hurt. However, if you don't get rolling, if you are just uh, losing trades and just being out space and or even getting camped out, then it can be very draining, I feel like, for the Luigi players. So it's not like it's all completely for free. We've all seen the memes as well, like people doing the like the combo with one hand and whatnot. However, like the neutral is a very different thing. And if uh, the player gets rattled, well, it could be even worse. But Law is working on some stuff right now and taking that first stock within seconds. And I mean, you have to come to me, but instead, no, he decides, you know what, if you're gonna sit in that platform, then I can just shoot some fireballs and maybe try to approach afterwards. Uh, and Sout was looking very dominant uh, by the end of that last game, but he oh, could very well oh, be losing a second oh, stock right oh, here. Oh, oh my oh. god, he's not gonna do it. No, he settles down for a hundred plus percent combo. My goodness, does this a character have the damage? I mean, he settles down like, bro, isn't that enough? You already did 100 damage to the heavyweight character by excellence, pal! And you're 
people taking his stock just by looking at him. It's very difficult and very just. Oh my god, you can feel the the despair coming from the gameplay of Sal right there. He just got zero to death almost twice. And right now he's just trying to get his his momentum back into this game, and it's very difficult because Law right here with an aggressive oh. and an oppressive offensive right there. Oh, this is gonna be it. This is gonna be a lot. No, 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 not quite yet. But dang, Sal just in a very desperate situation, my man. Yeah, and, and let me let me tell you, like that pivot forward smash, it was looking like perhaps a pivot grab that missed, uh, and uh, that would actually probably cost the stock. No cyclone, just delaying that read ever so slightly, but the advantage is so far on Law's side, and I mean you can't beat the Law, my man. You just can't that. King Koopa just flying straight off the left side. And I mean, you wouldn't be pressed to have forgotten just how things went on that first game. It was looking all like Sot Sot's set. But instead, look at that, just Law managing to bring it back in a very dominant fashion. And what I was saying, like, if the Luigi player gets rattled, he might just end up running into those bad situations over and over again. That could also very well happen to his opponent, right? Like, Luigi is very much a character that will cause you to go on tilt. That will cause you to, why am I getting hit by this hero to death combo and dying when I'm not supposed to and just getting pivot grabbed? I cannot deal with this. However, I do not presume to know exactly what South is playing like right now. So let's see if the adaptation is right there. He already got a game. I'm sure that he can get another one. Yes, and... and you see, preserving your mental, like you mentioned, against Luigi is very important. But you see, when that thing happens right there, it's very hard to preserve your mental against Bowser as well. You just lost one interaction and you took 45 damage. Given last game he did take over 100 off of one grab, right? But it's still very difficult. Like, you cannot compare the, the situation and, of course, the context in which you, you lose an interaction against Bowser and you, you can die. And... While you're fighting against Luigi, he does that, but that kind of benefits you as well because you get a lot of rage. So we're seeing right here that a lot of people say that heavyweights start playing whenever the percentage is right, and they're right because, like we're seeing right here, this could be enough, right, to in order to keep kill him. And that was all due to the fact that Law wasn't able to close out the stock. Yeah, I mean, it's very, very important to like actually finish your food, and those spot dodges working wonders right now, not falling for prey for like a common, I would say, Bowser trap, which is like, I can sit in shield, I can abuse my very, very good up B out of that specific defensive situation. So instead of that, some of those spot dodges coming in very clutch. 60% uh, almost, though, is not like a different, it's not, not a big difference when you're talking Luigi terms. And this is exactly why. This is exactly why he lapped him just in a couple of seconds. Like all it took was him getting touched only once and this ledge play has been crucial for both of them. Is he gonna go for the up B? He tries though, but getting the coin, however, no punish. My man's out actually pulling the trigger a little what? bit hard, but look at that. Oh, that was very, very dangerous. That force match just a straight up murders characters. Oh, what? Right there, what a call out. You're, like, you're gonna, you're gonna shoot me here. You're expecting an aerial? Nah, my man. Nah, just gonna grab you, hug you by the waist, and send you into the netherworld right there because what a call out with the side B, the flying slam, just taking Luigi's stock right there in a very impressive manner. And we're seeing yeah. that law, even though he has red percentage, we saw that last time. That really doesn't matter. What a ledge trump, what a ledge trump. Those Tim's doing work, boy. Those Tim's doing work. Uh, I, I mean, like, if you're gonna save that type of punish, now is the time to do it, and losing that conversion, that could very well be huge this time around. Sound has not been giving Law enough opportunities, but he does give away that, but a second miss this time around, 60%, we've seen Law die at near this uh, percentage. Uh, threshold as well, so it is, and he's not out of woods just yet. Sout going for the punish and getting the flying slam on the other side, and just trying to cover it. That law getting interrupted on his recovery, not getting caught by that get up attack. That was looking a little dicey. A lot fighting for center stage here, and this is the battle, and it's gonna be won by Sout after such a dominant game number two. We are seeing Law go into the loser's bracket. Great performance, just being able to keep the composure. Like I was saying, 
it's all going to depend on that mental game if he is able to keep himself composed and south did so so a great player like law is gonna not be immune